Hello Zebrahood and welcome back to Plant vs. Zombies Guarded Warfare 2. And today, we're gonna be going in and checking out yet another legendary hat. It's gonna be for the, the Sunflower again. It's not gonna be this hat, but instead the hat right next to it because Ruck sold this over the weekend. A lot of people were super excited about it. I was too, that I stayed up extra late to earn up coins. I didn't get much sleep this weekend. But uh, yeah, I had no coins, so I had to frantically go and earn them up to get it. But it is the Steven hat, and it's a weird one. It's toothpaste, and I guess Steven is the toothpaste, and he has a toothbrush on his head. It's weird. <laughs> But I love it, and we're gonna go ahead and check it out, have some fun with the sunflower, and just sort of see how it goes. We'll get a you know a couple vanquishes with it to see what its wonderful legendary effect is. Actually, no, is Steven a tooth? Yeah, Steven is a tooth. I thought he was like a blob of toothpaste that exploded out of the, the toothpaste canister. He is a tooth. Well, there we go, Steven the tooth. He loves toothpaste, he loves toothbrushes. Let's go ahead and uh, show everybody the power of dental hygiene. Okay, so let's get started with this hat. It looks really silly, so I'm excited to get a vanquish with it. It looks like we're at the end of the uh, Zombopolis map, which is pretty cool. But uh, yeah, this is, oh gosh, let's go ahead and get you, get you, get you, get you, get you. Ah, just an assist, would've been an awesome start. Oh well, oh here we go, you. My aim is super bad, I have not been playing much Garden Warfare 2. But uh, we do have another episode coming up soon. Of course, it's going to be checking out the new Super Mix mode for this week. Lots of awesome Garden Warfare stuff happening. Uh, Rux has been showing up twice a week, which has been a lot of fun. Um, okay, where are you at? You're over this way. Some of you were letting me know that uh, the game director to Garden Warfare 2 was tweeting about the new updates that might be coming to the game at some point or another. Um, especially that they don't seem like they're coming anytime soon and they wanna know my thoughts on that. And I think that's totally fine. Honestly, when they announced back at E3 that they're gonna work on more Garden Warfare 2 content, I wasn't expecting anytime soon. I think that was them announcing that they're going to start working on something, not that they have been. So I wouldn't expect, if there is, and like at this point I would say, uh, not to expect the world over, you know? Just like, I would just expect maybe there might be a couple legendary hats, but if above and beyond they really do do something amazing, uh, like do a totally new expansion like they do with Troubles and Mopolis and Frontline Fighters and everything in between Trials and Omas as well, um, I would say that I wouldn't expect that maybe not until the end of this year, maybe next year. Just looking at how those things, how long those things take to make, you know? I mean, we saw that with Trials and Nomus, that they were working on Trials and Nomus. It confirmed even when Garden Warfare 2 was still being developed, the game itself, conceptually, was still being worked on. And then since then, it was being worked on even more, of course, after the game had launched. So it takes a long time to make that kind of stuff, even if it is just an update. So, uh,. Let's try to actually get a vanquish. Anyways, a lot of people were asking me about that, so I wanted to go ahead and answer it as soon as possible. For this hat, though, I want to express my thoughts on it, but I want to see the legendary effect. There we go! <laughs> he just jumps up and down, he squirts the toothpaste out. Oh, I love it, he does a little flip, ow! Can't you just let me be? I'm trying to enjoy toothpaste! Okay, I'm fine, I'm fine. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna win this one. I mean, I just joined, so there isn't really too much of a you know, progress I can make with my team. But like, I mean, I guess I could. Let's go over there and try to help. I'm a little rusty at the moment though, to say the least. Like, I'm trying to do better. But I love this legendary hat. What an awesome effect. Like, that's really cool. So, I'm happy about that one. Okay, so let's try to help out everybody around here. Looks like we got this soldier. Like, I'm hitting everybody a little bit, but not enough to actually land a vanquish. Oh, the double though. There we go, it was good. Multi-vanquish and everything. Okay, so the Zombot's uh, weakened at the moment, so I wanna go for him as quickly as possible, but this guy's gonna ruin my fun, and his friend is also gonna try to do that. Leave me alone, you bullies. Leave me alone. Come on, just heal myself up, destroy this battery. It's not gonna happen, is it? I tried, though, I tried. Maybe I should've just gone for a couple more vanquishes instead. I mean, I'm not gonna get very many, but at the same time, get him in fun. But anyways, now that we've seen the awesome legendary effect of Steven here, I would love to hear your thoughts on him. Do you think he's a worthwhile uh, legendary hat? Or do you think he isn't worth the five, oh gosh, that was weird, 500,000 coins that I had to spend for him. Uh, I would love to hear your thoughts on that, so be sure to let me know. But we'll just get up here and uh, try to destroy you a little bit, sir. But yeah, we're gonna be checking out the new Super Mix Mode next episode, I think that's a repeat, but it'll still be pretty cool, I think. Let's get back to that battery. We have 40 seconds, we might be able to win. Okay, dude, where are you going? What are you doing? You're getting healed, that's for sure. You know what, I'm just going to Oh gosh, get destroyed by a chemist most likely. Oh gosh, they're everywhere. I thought there's more zombies in our plants. I mean, at least I'm seeing a lot more zombies in plants. Get rid of that guy, thank you. I like the little jingle that plays with it too, because this is like original music, I think, which is always cool. Whenever there's like original little songs that play with them, that's always a nice touch, because you don't always get that. 
Uh, got that, that was pretty good. Don't think they'll expect me to come up this way, so if I can spend 10 seconds, 10 seconds just destroying this battery, it ain't gonna happen. Oh, uh, well, I tried, I tried. <laughs> Didn't have much health going into there, but even then I did some good damage to this guy. Okay, well, I joined late, so I'm not expecting a bunch of awesome stuff there, but at the same time, we got some fun stuff done, so that was great. So uh, yeah, there is a quick look at the hat, but we're gonna keep going and we're gonna have some more fun. I actually really like how the hat looks with the power flower, just because, I don't know, it sort of has a shiny white, I know it's supposed to be like electrical blue, but it almost has like a shiny white look to her, so I think just color wise, it sort of matches pretty well, not in this darkness, I guess, but in the lighting of the character select screen, it looked pretty good, I think it's a nice little addition. Oh gosh, who's attacking me already? Come on, I just spawned in, that's not cool. Get out of here, get out of here right now. Okay, you know, if, I'm gonna win that battle. <laughs> oh, I don't have a heal flower, is he? I gotta change that. Steven is adorable. I just think he stands for everything that's good in this world. <laughs> Clean teeth, a good smile, something to smile about. He's just so happy, he's passionate. Passion is another thing. Okay, it's laggy. <laughs> laggy game, or at least laggy online games. That's not something to live by, but that's okay, it happens. Sometimes there are necessities of life and I've gone on a massive tangent and I'm not really good at the power flower apparently. Okay, run soldier, run. Okay, so let's go ahead and spawn something in. It might help us get past this first point. Yeah, this is a very cool legendary hat. Hopefully they can keep moving on. This one was totally out of left field for me, but I think it was awesome. And hopefully that's just sort of something we see. Like, you know, I really wouldn't mind if there is like, you know, like obviously I would love it if there is a brand new DLC expansion on the way. Uh, you know, something of a scale of, you know, Trials and Nomus or Frontline Fighters. But even if that's like, say, six, seven, even eight months away, maybe nine months, you know? I wouldn't mind, as long as like every other week we get a new legendary hat or new ability and beyond, that they just sort of take their time, right? I would love that. And there goes Steven again. Like, yeah. Okay, I know there's people attacking me, so I quickly want to just vanquish whoever I can. That's a pea shooter, so I don't have to worry about him. There is a soldier up here, but right now I'm not hitting them very easily. I got him a little bit. Oh, here we go, here we go. Ooh, nice. Because I think that would be awesome, you know? I feel like that's what the you know the community really needed uh, for Garden Warfare 2, was that after Frontline Fighters, I feel like the game sort of took a nosedive in that way. And we've talked about it so many times. But since, you know, it's sort of becoming a hot topic, again, I wanted to talk about it again, is that when it came to incoming to content, uh, after Frontline Fighters, the first like half of 2017, the game definitely took a bit of a nosedive in the way that there was like very, very little content to really enjoy. They announced that they weren't gonna do any more DLC expansions, and with that, there was next to no hats. There were no new boss hunts, except for like there was one in January 2017, and that was the uh, Yeti, but that was the last one to release, and since then, we've only had the same four boss fights over and over again. And I think that while, yes, a DLC expansion will be amazing, I think what we need more than that is just a steady flow of consistent content. I think every month there should either be a brand new legendary hat, I mean, of course, I think there should be new legendary hats, new abilities, new boss hunts, and they can work on that stuff on the forefront and slowly on the side, maybe work on a new DLC expansion. I mean, I don't know how large the team is, what they're capable of, so maybe that's asking for too much. But in a perfect world, I think that would be the most optimal thing is that, let the thing that's gonna take a long time take a long time, and let's get some stuff out that'll keep the community happy in little bursts for a long time, I think. I think that a lot of people would just, you know, if we had a new boss hunt every three months, and we had a new legendary hat and ability every month, I feel like by the end of the you know, 2018, I think a lot of the community will be able to look back and go, wow, this was a lot of fun, this was really cool. And then maybe for the start of 2019, we're graced with the presence of a new DLC, like some new characters, a new map, something like that. I feel like that'd be so cool. So hopefully that's what's down the pipeline. I feel like that would be the best time. I don't know what this guy's doing. He's just in a punching frenzy and I can't vanquish him because there's a chomper in the way. There we go. Go at it, Steven. Okay, so uh, I see this guy over that way. Oh geez. Can I get him? I don't know. Let's try to move over this way. Oh, okay, Chomper got him. <laughs> All right, so let's go this way and see what we can do. I don't see too many other zombies. I still need to change my uh, thing to a healing flower, but at the same time, it hasn't been hurting too much. There are some people that really, really don't like the dark flower. I can sort of understand, but at the same time, I don't think it's that big of a deal. If it helps, it helps. It definitely can be helpful in something like uh, uh, Garden Ops. That can always be great. I'm trying to get this guy. He's just sort of jumping around like a little lunatic. 
There's another breakfast sprint as well. My aim is awful, I'm so sorry. Let's go ahead and try to get him. Oh, there's two, did he just multiply? That was weird. There was one imp, and then there were two imps. Like it, that was weird. <laughs> did you guys see like an imp ran by and then boom, there were two imps. I know that there was probably just already an imp standing behind there, but for a moment, it looked like the imps have multiplied. <laughs> Looks like we're going against Infinity from PVZ Heroes. Okay, so let's go around the left then and see what we can do. It looks like uh, some people are taking the point, that's awesome. I mean, I was just trying to weaken their defenses and then you know, maybe somebody can move in and get some work done. Get rid of you, sir, if I can. My aim is awful and you move around too quickly. Somebody will get you. Being a little lazy, gotta be honest. Okay, get it, get it, get it, got it. Good stuff. So I need to be careful because of the fact, oh gosh, yeah, there's a mech waiting for us. And there's another one, two little drakes. Would have been tough just against one. No, chopper friend. Oh my gosh, that was a mess. Okay, I'm gonna get the healing flower out. I feel like it would help me a little bit more in this situation. But I do like this hat a lot, and I definitely wanna hear your thoughts on it. <laughs> just, he's so happy. He is just so pleased. Okay, so, um, uh, I'm in the wrong spot. I need to go to character. No, I need to go to abilities. And let's do rainbow flower. I never do rainbow flower, so we'll do it right now and see what ends up happening. Okay, I'm gonna hang out with this chomper and we'll see how things go. We're both power characters, both have that power of electricity. Oh, I see that that scientist is soldier. There's this, oh my gosh, there's everything everywhere. Attack the mechs first then, because we can get that cool electric damage and it'll sort of spread between the both of them. Come on, get him, get him, get him. Ah, oh, I should've put out my heal flower. I was just a little afraid. But we got rid of the mech and the soldier and this guy's down to 33%. I think the rest of the team might be able to get him. Good job, team. Okay, they did. So uh, let's head back in and try that again. There's a soldier over here, doesn't need too much healing. Okay, so there's a lot of guys over This is probably gonna go right for me. Oh, no, it didn't. He was trying to attack the chomper, I suppose. So get that guy a little bit. Oh, here we go, here we go. Damage that imp a little bit. Where is he? Where is he? I got him a little bit more. Oh, man, my aim is so bad today, I'm so sorry. Okay, got him. Steven's happy about that one. I'll do anything to please Steven at this point, he's great. Get the scientist, oh, whoa, whoa, he just sort of teleported. All right, so we got this point, good job, everybody. Get rid of this healing station, because why not? Oh gosh, hey, who's that? Leave me alone. Protect me, heal flower. Protect me, Steven. The power of healthy teeth. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is funny, I like it. But you know, this is just what I want out of a legendary hat, is it doesn't have to be a reference to anything, it doesn't even have to be anything that makes any sense. I just want it to make me smile every time I get a vanquish. Because I'm already gonna be smiling, I just got a vanquish, so I might as well smile even more, you know? Yeah, how great is that? I, I just feel like there are some legendary hats that definitely we've seen that aren't the best, but some of them are just like totally awesome, like this one. Okay, so hopefully we see more. I mean, I know we've been checking out a couple sunflower hats recently. Of course, this one, we checked out the uh, boomerang uh, kangaroo one. I always forget, I already forget his name, but I checked out that a couple of episodes ago and that was fun. Okay, I'm trying to get this guy a little bit. It's not going out too well. Oh boy. Okay, so let's try to be a little bit more careful about this. There are guys shooting at me from everywhere including a marine biologist, or no, he's not a marine. He's a scuba soldier. Wrong one, Whoa, okay, ow, everybody's trying to take me out right now. I'm in a pretty easy sp spot area, and that's not on top of the fact that I'm like an electric variant, so I'm just gonna be making like a lot of like visuals with the sparking and stuff. There we go. Five banquet streak right now, let's try to get that a little bit higher. Oh, let's get the guy right in front of me. Oh no, oh no, oh, I walked right into that. I don't know who I was bumping into there, but there's somebody to my left I kept, I was trying to run to the left and the person was in the way. Couldn't do anything about it. Oh no, I'm being made to dance with Steven. <laughs> Why is that a bad thing? It isn't. Okay, so let's go ahead and get another one of these and we'll, we'll go ahead and get a porcelain in. And we'll just try to sneak on over there. Don't know if we'll take the point. There's one plant on the point already. And then he's off, then he's on, and then there's two of them. That's pretty good. Oh, oh, what are you doing, dude? You're just standing here, so I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Try to take out whoever we can from the angle that we're at. We might be able to get an easy approach to the point. Okay, there are zombies everywhere. Come on, take this point. Attack this super brains. And anybody else who dares stands in our way. Okay, we did okay. I see this engineer, I'm trying to get him. We're gonna take this point. We're definitely, I think, doing better than the enemy team right now. I don't know where they're running. They're not gonna be able to get the point back. 
Okay, yeah, they just sort of ran away, they gave up. <laughs> they still got me, but they definitely gave up on trying to protect the plane. He's at 2% health, somebody get him! Oh, well, somebody will get him, I'm sure. Oh, I see this imp, no, never mind, imp is gone. I'll heal this, this rose up. I see you over there, don't you spawn in your mech, what are you, get out of here with that. Get out of here with this, get out of here with everything. <laughs> okay, try to get rid of them. Oh, we're getting that uh, electric bounce damage going on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And we got you, nice. Let's celebrate with Steven. Okay, so it seems like we've gotten all the zombies that were hanging out by our point, so that's pretty good. It's our point now, it was their point, but not any longer. Is there anything in this sewer? I guess not. <laughs> It'd be cool if there was. I thought that'd be a pretty cool Easter egg, because it's such in like this little corner where you don't see things, but uh, I guess not. But I guess we'll have to start brainstorming, right? Like, if we really do want to expect to do DLC expansion for this game, what would you guys like to see it about? You know, like, we've sort of seen different themes for things, I guess. I mean, overall, you know, like, with uh, Trouble in Zombopolis, it was all about uh, Zomboss in, in Zombopolis, and then, you know, this whole map, and then sort of it being, like, superheroes in the city with uh, uh, Breakfast Brains and Toxic Citron and stuff, you know? And then for Trials and Gnomes, of course, it was all about the gnomes. Um, for frontline fighters, it was sort of just like, I guess sort of just another chapter of them fighting over the lawn. And we just had some uh, pretty cool additions. We had four variants added with that one, which was pretty crazy. I mean, there really wasn't a specific theme for frontline fighters, I feel. I felt like it was just sort of like a combination of a bunch of cool stuff. I mean, I would like to see them get a little bit more adventurous. I mean, maybe I should save it for, for a different video. You gotta keep talking about Steven. But there's, there's so many cool ideas, and I hope they really do uh, live up to the different possibilities that they could do, because there's a lot of fun stuff. But for right now, though, let's reload and head back in. I see a couple of guys who I might be able to damage, but at the same time, I don't really trust it. I want to damage on the mech a little bit before he even notices I'm here. Oh, gosh, he's noticed that I'm here. Mayday, mayday. Oh, gosh, it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt. Oh, he, he ran away. Oh. Oh, Torchwood friends, here for the save! My squad came in at the perfect time! That rarely happens in this game. Usually the opposite. Thank you guys so much, you're the best. We had the best team ever. They came in to save me, I feel so loved. Okay, oh gosh, we gotta reload, gotta reload, gotta reload. Oh, get him, get him, get him. Good job, good job, I'm gonna heal who I can. I'm gonna revive who I can. I got it, don't worry. Ah, no, I don't got it. <laughs> I've made an awful mistake. But man, that was so cool. Usually like, I'll go in with the team, I'll like, heal, it's all taken out, and then they all scatter for no reason. Um, but this time, I was I thought I was gonna get taken out, and then boom, the whole team just arrives to help me, and we're like, let's go take this point. And look at that, we took the point. How proud am I? Very proud. So we had a chance of doing this at the beginning of the episode, we didn't do so well, but hopefully now with our second chance, we can get Zombot taken down. We'll have to first get rid of any engineer or soldier in our way. Like this dude, come on, get you, get you, get you, get you, get you. Oh my gosh, I can't believe he got me. I mean, he is a Sky Trooper. That sort of makes sense, but uh, geez, he was already on fire when I started attacking him, so you would think I would have some kind of advantage, but no. So let's just try to get rid of these guys. I mean, maybe I should just ignore them, but at the same time, probably not. Because if I could just get to the battery and start damaging it while everybody else is fighting around here, that'd be great. So this guy's just like, I don't know what to do. <laughs> he just wanted to be sent back to the spawn, I guess. Oh no, Chomper. Oh gosh, me. Gotta be careful. He jumped really higher than I thought there. The problem for him right now is that he can't keep up. Got it, awesome, that was perfect. So, let's move this way. I mean, we it really isn't that big of a game of Turf Takeover. Looks like we do have the advantage. So I'm just gonna sit up here and start destroying this battery. Come on, just start doing some numbers to it and also get rid of you while I can, or at least a little bit. Come on, keep going, keep going. I can damage this guy a little bit, but not by a lot. Okay, I gotta reload. <laughs> not good timing. Oh gosh, they're gonna try to get me in a moment, I think. Yo, let's heal him up. We'll get the heal flower right there. Okay, so nobody's gonna get taken up by that. Oh gosh, watch out, jump! <laughs> gotta be careful, <laughs> gotta keep moving. I wanna sneak over to this side and see what I can do. I mean, the power flower doesn't pack too much of a punch, of course, because she has that splash damage. Oh gosh, she's gonna notice me. But if I can just keep damaging this battery, that's sort of the thing, not too many people are damaging the battery. All right, so I know they're gonna attack me, so let me just full force, ah, oh, okay. Maybe I should've gotten rid of that soldier. I don't really know. 
I think like we did okay. It's down to half health now. The problem is we just don't have a big enough team to really do too much damage to the Zombot when we do this. Already down to two minutes, so... I don't know how well this is gonna work. We'll try, though. Let's go up this way. I do see some uh, soldiers and stuff. Get him, get him, get him. Got him, nice stuff. Oh gosh, watch out, he's gonna slam! Oh, oh, that could've been bad. I mean, he stunned us, but he didn't squish us, which is a good thing. Destroy this battery, come on. This guy doesn't quite see me, so this is a perfect opportunity just to start laying on some damage. Let's go ahead and do this then. Oh, hello, perfect timing for you, I guess. Perfectly awful for me. Okay, got it, I need to destroy something real quick. I know this guy's probably gonna attack me, the little imp behind me, but if I could just break this fuse or at least make some good progress with it, and then, uh, let's go like destroy this one. This is the one we really wanna get rid of because it's just so hard to reach from except, except from this angle, so if we could just get rid of it, that'd be perfect. So I'm just gonna try to work on that. I don't think anybody's gonna sink down this way, so I'm just gonna keep attacking it until hopefully it's gone for good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We need more teammates attacking it. This is not gonna work out. If we don't get rid of this fuse, we're definitely not gonna be able to beat uh, the Zombot. Yeah, we got it! Awesome, good job, good job. So I'm gonna sneak up here where the uh, battery is back to ticking down, or at least the timer is back to ticking down. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Just keep attacking this guy until he isn't here anymore. Thank you! Steven's happy about that one. I am too. Just ignore everyone, except for this guy, because he's too tempting. He's too easy. Oh boy. Maybe if I was closer, I'd be doing more damage, but... Oh gosh, what do you want? Get out of here. Thank you, Chomper, you're the best. I love you. Leave me alone. Not, not Chomper, the imp. <laughs> Come on, just keep attacking. For whatever reason, we're not attacking there. Oh, the battery's so low now. If we can get rid of that back fuse so quickly, I know we can get rid of the rest of the fuses. I mean, hopefully. We'll have to wait and see. Come on, come on, we gotta get back out there in 50 seconds. How many more fuses do we have left? I think only two. I think his front and his left arm, or his right, our left, where we're currently facing. We can do that. We can hit, no problemo. He's just gonna slam with this arm though, because he doesn't have the other arm to slam. So get on over this way. Try to destroy these guys a little bit, but not too much. I need to focus on the battery. Got him. Go ahead and just start focusing on this a little bit. Leave me alone, sir. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. You're a bully. You're bullying me. I don't like it. Please, stop. Yes, yes, okay. Turn back. Um. Oh gosh, can't hop down that way. Ooh, I need to get rid of the Sky Trooper. He's been beating me up all episode. He's just still running. <laughs> you know what, yeah, you keep running, buddy. I can't believe it took me that long to get you. Ah, you slam it on me. I need to get this one. I need to get this fuse. Come on, we have not much time to get this. If we don't get it now, it's game over. You stinker. <laughs> Darn it. We might be able to just respawn and immediately do our thing again now. Come on, quickly, 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 quickly. Oh gosh, 27 seconds, but we might not actually have that long. Oh gosh, no! <laughs> we were so close. That's not fair. Dang it. Come on, I'm gonna get rid of this dude. Get my anger out a little bit. What is going on here with the hitbox of this thing? That stinks. There's no way we're gonna be able to break the battery in this amount of time. Oh no, oh no, it's all over, it's all done for. Jeez, that stinks though. We were so close yet so far. Ugh, oh well. This is always a tough one, especially in like an incomplete team. It's next to impossible, but we tried. We had a good time. We got to check out the wonderful Steven hat, so do I really have anything to complain about? If you have a happy little tooth like that, you really can't be doing all that bad, can you? <laughs> so he's gonna fly off and destroy the world if the Kurtacorn tried to stop him. Like, no, not the world. But he's only gonna have to do it one arm, so hopefully wherever he goes to fight, he won't be there for very long. Anyways, we want everything up to that point. We did fantastic as a team. That's really the best you can almost imagine doing as that small of a team without it being a full team. So 21,000 coins, not too bad. We might've got top vanquisher. Uh, yes, we did not. <laughs> but we got top assist and top healing. The top healing one's not too surprising, but awesome stuff, that's very cool. So there we go, there is a look at the Steven legendary hat. Definitely one of my favorite of all time, what a cool, cute, and fun little hat. I would love to hear your thoughts on it. Do you think it's worth 500,000 coins? And yeah, 
Those are your thoughts in general. With that being said, I've almost forgotten, but I won't. Uh, last week's community challenge was very fruitful and we were able to get all three of the rewards. We already checked out the first reward in the community challenge video, but there are still two more uh, things to open up, the red community pack and the blue. One of these should be an infinite chest and then the other one should be a legendary. I think this one's gonna be the infinite. So let's go ahead and open up that one. I'm super excited for it. We get ourselves nice three uh, scrumptious and infinite things. We got the infinite future face wrap, the scrumptious pool Pinsnez, whatever that means. Scrumptious burnt over mitts, very cool. And then we got the red community pack. Now this should have a legendary, but for me, just gonna be 100,000 coins, which I won't complain about. And why that is, if you're wondering, is because I already have all the legendaries that can possibly show up in the legendary community challenge pack, which is the base legendary, so stuff like Rux doesn't show up in there. But with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2. If you watch this part of video, make sure you comment Zebra Steven, so now you've watched the end of the You're a Zebra Tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.